Japan's sustainable water management system is run mainly by farmers who operate and manage irrigation facilities. Known as a model for participatory irrigation management or PIM, this system is expanding worldwide. This video features Japan's system along with JICA's initiatives. In ancient Japan, village-based water user associations operated and managed irrigation facilities and the distribution of irrigation water for agriculture. To secure water, irrigation systems were gradually created after repeated disputes, sometimes severe enough to end in death. From the 19th century, the government actively introduced Western technology and developed barren lands into vast grain belts throughout the country. Enactment of the Land Improvement Act in 1949 allowed existing irrigation associations to be prescribed as land improvement districts and enabled large-scale agricultural irrigation development led by farmers. Along with further progress in agricultural mechanization and farmland consolidation, the aim of projects shifted from a phase of farmland expansion to enhancing productivity and improving farmer income. These efforts have resulted in rice production volumes exceeding domestic consumption and the ability to convert to crops other than rice. Joint management of agricultural water has developed over many years in tandem with such infrastructure improvements. The total length of irrigation facilities in Japan is actually 400,000 kilometers. At the core of their management are farmer associations called Land Improvement Districts, or LIDs. Based on water rights obtained from bodies such as the national government, LIDs operate facilities that take in and drain water and farmers divide up responsibilities for maintenance and management with LIDs as the origin. A feature of LIDs is that full-time staff are employed as secretariats of river basin units and basic costs are covered by membership fees. This very structure where members engage as stakeholders strengthens the sense of ownership towards joint management of irrigation facilities. Conversely, around the world, after the introduction of irrigation facilities, maintenance and management become a heavy burden, resulting in increasing cases where these facilities are not used properly. This has turned the focus increasingly towards participatory irrigation management, where the farmers play a major role in managing the facilities. Stable supply of food is the foundation of economic development. JICA undertakes technical cooperation by dispatching experts to support its achievement. The the people who met with the experts, JICA, or our expert teams, and those who are maybe working together, there's a lot of things that has been changing in their mind. After the uh, establishment of water user organizations, demolishing of the, uh, of the structures or preventing water to go to the till end of the canal uh, decreased uh, a lot. So it uh, enhanced their product and also they become uh, willing to cultivate. JICA also collaborates with land improvement districts to conduct issue-based training in order to deepen understanding of participatory irrigation management.
使うか行動に移すかっていうところを求めているのでそのヒントを日本で得て帰ってくださいねっていうふうに考えています。In order to realize a step by step approach according to conditions in each country, JICA continues various forms of cooperation aimed at building local systems and embedding those systems and technologies. Let's work together to build a participatory irrigation system that suits your country.